Martin is a small-scale farmer in Malawi. His tobacco crop has been ravaged by drought. For me, this year is my last. I have given up growing tobacco and I am cultivating potatoes. They fetch even better prices and I can buy fertilizer for my other crops. I can hardly make a living from tobacco because it is being bought in cents. Tobacco is the country's biggest export crop. The government has tried to cushion the blow by setting a minimum price, but buyers aren't paying it. Companies are also contracting individual farmers to buy directly from them. Farmers like Martin and Benson lose out as a result. It used to be profitable when we were selling the auction because we were all selling in the same place and the buyers would compete for a higher price. But now with the contract system, the buyers are really reaping from us. They are making us poorer. And the tobacco traders like Auction Holdings Group says it's unlikely to get better for farmers. But as a country, we know we are doing, uh, the government is promoting diversification, but those farmers that relied much on tobacco this year uh, will suffer a big blow because they are experiencing low prices and also their tobacco is, is being rejected. Farmers have little option but to diversify. It's the only way to feed their families. But the drought is putting even that in doubt. Leslie Marungu, CCTV.